Is it recording? Is it recording? Yeah. <laughs> Hello my good friends of YouTube. Well, today guys, you've all been ask, asking and uh, waiting very patiently. I am going to show you my big microwave oven transformer. She's a big bitch. Um, the primary voltage guys on this, which I shall show you. Oh, of course I've got John still with me when we're messing about. The primary voltage of this is your COM, and of course 380 and 415, and the output, still live. and it's still live which I'm not going to touch. Um, I've only got it ballasted at the minute, guys. It's 2018, 2110, and 2235. Now, with this being quite a high voltage, um, primary, of 380 to 415, I have not connected it to the COM. I've connected it to the 380 and 415, which is going to basically up the output. Now, just on 500, uh, sorry, 1500 watts, this is what the output we've got. It's about 10 kV guys. Now let's up the wattage. Oh no, one second, let me just quickly check. It's cold as ice. Beautiful. It's cold. Right, let's up it to 2000. Oh, yeah, you got a nice little hum off that. Uh, let's put it up to 3000. That's about 20 kV that is. Ah. Come on, keep going dude, keep going. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. <laughs> That's easily 20 kV. Oh, Let's test the uh, temperature. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the prime is getting just warm. Just warm. But you see, it's ballasted, you see, so it can't draw, it can't pull any more current than what it's being given. So, round here is cold, it's just a bit warm around here. Just warm, like, you know, like like your missus when you wake up in the morning, she's oh, red hot, yeah. you know what I mean, that sort of warmth. So, <laughs> definitely, if I suppose if you did bring down the, the wattage a little bit, you could play with that all day. So let's say we'll just give it to 2,000 watts, and that, I reckon you would be quite comfortable at doing that all day. But we don't want to do that. Oh, that's naughty. <laughs> I can't leave that up there like that. <clears throat> Certainly smell the uh, the arc off there. But yes, guys. Secondary freezing cold. Core, the iron core freezing cold. But there's my hand. That'll just give you a reason of how big this thing is. It's very big. I wish I had a normal mock just to hold next to it. It'd be like a dwarf, <laughs> but like a dwarf against a fucking seven foot man. It looks like three times the size of a regular one. Oh god, and yeah, four, more, four times I'd say, four yeah. times in the size. But, uh, the phone will focus nicely. There we go. 
give you a nice look around it guys I've got some more of these saved at the scrapyard imagine a few of those in series <laughs> oh, parallel bloody hell it certainly pulls the certainly pulls the amps if you just if you tried to wire this without no ballast guys onto what I've done there you would draw so much current you'd blow your mains I'm telling you now because even at, um, I think it was about 40 volts I was putting into it, it was drawing 40 amps, uh, you know, and it just kept on going every, every, every volt you went up. So you definitely need to balance something like this if you haven't got a nice source of 380 or 415 volts primary. So I thought I'd uh, show you that, guys, because I know a lot of you have been waiting for it. So thanks for watching. Look after yourselves. <laughs> oh, uh, explosive garden just there, John. Oh. Certainly a beast, definitely. So, take care, guys. Speak to you again. Look after yourselves. Whatever projects you're doing, of course, I always have to tell you be safe. Be safe. No, be safe. Always be safe. I can't stop. Be safe. Be <laughs> safe, guys. I can't stop. Please tell me. Force of habit. I, 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 just be safe, okay? <laughs> you. Yes, you. Looking. Be safe, whatever you're doing. Honestly, whatever you're doing, be safe. I'm going to have to stop. <laughs> <laughs> See you later, guys. <laughs>